Okay, so today I'll be doing a review on one slash one forty four high grade Gundam Age Gundam Age One Titus model kit made from Bandai. It's the fifth of five in the series. Made in two thousand eleven. Retails for one thousand two hundred yen. That looks nice. Here's the sticker paper. Bro. Okay. Mm. You get a big runner, runner G, uh, as in Gundam. <laughs> big clear effect parts. Wow. Good. I still don't really like this whole ring thingy on the arm. I mean, it's okay, but it's. I don't know, just stupid. Anyway. Runner F. Then runner E. Runner D. Wow, it's really tiny A runner. Wow. Okay. That's a cool runner tag. Actually, what is that? Probably gonna f find out, but this is, this is what I'm talking about right here. Cause it seems like you can take this thing off. I wonder what this is. Just a extra runner tag, or if I don't find out, just uh, let me know in the comment section below. If I do find out as I'm making the kit, okay, I will let you guys know what this is all about. Anyway. Here's the run-up sheet, and that's about it. It's the instruction manual. Reminds me that weapon from Halo. Here's the color guide. Okay, freeze frame. No. Nope. Okay. Here's what the completed kit looked like. Okay, here's the finished build. Um, so yeah, I used all the clear uh, effect parts that came with it. All the needles, the disc on the arm. I think it, uh, did a straight build, some basic panel lining, that's about it. I think it turned out pretty good. Yep, uh, let me know what you think on the comment section below. Very nice sculpt. Very good mold. I use the action base too with it. Alright, so thank you for watching and see you in the next video.